Tracy. I'm Ted. We met last summer. I just moved from Michigan. If you, you see, see a pleasant, pleasant peninsula, peninsula, look about, about you. <laughs> it's a state, state motto. motto. Our friends always tease us for completing, completing each, each other's, other's sentences. sentences. It's actually my friend Nell who introduced us. I was a kindergarten teacher in Michigan. And then something happened. And I moved to New York and became a um, locksmith. And I had just locked myself out of my apartment and I called Nell and she's like, you've gotta call this guy. He's a, a really great locksmith. He can break into almost anything. And he's kind of a dreamboat. I was seeing someone at the time, so I, it was strictly professional when I called him. Brendan Lee Michaels. I've seen this guy, Brendan. Anyway, Ted showed up and he looked so cute. He'd broken his arm, so he was wearing this like big cumbersome cast. I work as a physical therapist, so when I saw the cast on Ted's arm, I invited him to my office for free physical therapy. But like an idiot, I forgot to give him the directions. He has a really good sense of direction. His arm took a really long time to heal. It still hurts. Sometimes I think he was just making up elaborate excuses just to keep seeing me. Like remember that one time you called me at 4 a.m. to help? He had these like really heavy barrels in his garage and he called me <laughs> out. We didn't really take it to the next level until the guy that I had been seeing at the time walked out on me totally just disappeared without even a note, but uh... Yeah, he just disappeared. Yeah, he disappeared. But Ted was there. Ted was really there for me. Our first kiss? God, I don't remember. You remember the second kiss, but the first kiss, she was actually... She was asleep. But then when I woke up, it was like a fairy tale. Park is this pet cemetery. This pet cemetery is very important to Ted because it's where he first. It's where I first buried my dog. And it's where I proposed to Gracie. It's where he proposed. I wanted to be creative with how I proposed, uh, so instead of a box, I decided on a plastic finger because real fingers, if detached from the body, just shrivel up. And if left on a body, they'll swell up like little balloons. Because of the bacteria that eats away at the internal organs, builds up a gas and is released in the lower extremities. He's like a medical dictionary. 